friends, today I'm going to make a raw fruit juicing as well but I'm experimenting it with a different uh, material. So this is called lemongrass. I have not tried lemongrass uh, in raw fruit juicing so I'm going to try it today. So I'm going to cut away ants. Cut them. Now for lemongrass it's quite hard. Huh? It's a uh, a lot of fiber so it may, it may be very taxing on the juicing machine so I'm gonna cut it into smaller pieces throw away those the, that is the color has, you know, has changed so now I'm gonna start cutting the lemon grass I'm gonna use one orange, one green apples, and half a sengkuang together with the lemongrass to produce raw fruit juicing. And I'm eager to taste it to see how it feels like. I'm gonna peel off the skin for this green apple first. Now I have washed it in the water. But because this is not organic, so I always peel uh, away all the skin of the fruits that I'm using. After two days of uh, raw fruit juicing, I am delighted to tell you that uh, my constipation is gone and I feel good right now. As for orange, I'm not going to put the skin into the uh, blender as well. I'm just I'm going to take the, the juice here. So I'm going to have to peel off the skin. Now this orange is going to give uh, the sweetness, the sweet taste to the fruit juice. This is, and I'm going to start cutting the apples. The ingredient I'm going to use will be this sengkuang, half a piece of Okay, I have to cut this into smaller pieces first so that it's easy to peel the skin. Sengkuang skin is quite hard and it's relatively difficult to get rid of them. Sometimes I'll just do this. I like the taste of sengkuang. It is a a little bit like a creamy kind of sense so I whenever I make fruit juice I always input some guang into the mix so now I'm gonna to have to clean some guang 
There's not much to clean anyway because we are using uh, orange, green apple, sung kwang, and lemongrass. So I just need to clean this. I'm gonna put all the materials into this plate first before I start with the uh, dicing this. Um, we are experiencing shortage of uh, fruits and vegetable since the uh, online delivery service is having a very good business so the delivery schedule has somehow screwed up I'm expecting a lot of uh, fruits and veggies to arrive today but I called them out and they said you know they will arrive only tomorrow so I just use what I have to do the juicing This is uh, Kuvik's uh, cold press machine. I use this machine to press um, fruit juice and sometimes uh, vegetable juice. Yeah, and it's very useful. Uh, this is the main part of the body, which is quite heavy. This is the second part, whereby the uh, remnants of the fruit or vegetable is going to come up from here. And the fresh juice is going to flow out from this particular tap looking outlet. So I'm going to put them in the right place. Okay. Now, this is actually the something that uh, is squirreling. Okay, it's quite heavy as well. It is used to squeeze the juice out from the fruit. Okay, it has a small container like this. You can put it in. Okay, I'm going to fix it right here. Match with the red dots on your sheet, so that is the right direction. Okay, it's fixed now. now. The third part consists of this one. You cover this here. To close it, you turn it this way. To open it, you turn it this way. So, eyes is closed, anti clockwise is open. So now, see, open. But we don't want to open it, we want to put it back. So we have to close it. So it is closed. This is the container that I'm going to use to collect the fruit juice. And this one is for me to collect the remnants from the fruits. Okay? Now we use these, you know, just in case there are big chunks of fruits or vegetables there, we have to just use this one to squeeze in. But since I have already cut my fruits into smaller pieces, I don't really need this one. Okay, let's get started. I will put in the Seng Kwang first. And start. Look at the outlet. This is the juice from the sink. Okay. I'm gonna add some more. This time I'm gonna add some apples. Lemongrass. Mm, it smells good, but I do not know how it's gonna taste like after the mixture. So I'm also experimenting. Okay. 
ingredients that I have. Okay, that's it. Bye-bye.